Hello, this is Goku for the Sum One, and I'm here to talk about the new Dark Knight Rises news with the first promotional image of Anne Hathaway as Selena Kyle. Now, they ha didn't call her Catwoman, but when I first saw this image, the first thing I thought of is that I can't wait to hear my subscribers on YouTube and to hear what they have to say because everyone's going to be happy. And then I started to read the comments of the image on many websites and people were talking about how they didn't like it, how she wasn't sexy, how this is not accurate to Catwoman. And then I started to hear my uh, suburbs and oh my god, these people are idiots. That's the only thing I can say because these people were saying this is not comic book accurate, this is not Catwoman, this is not what she wears, uh, this is horrible. And I have to 100% disagree. People have been saying things like, this is not Catwoman. What is Nolan doing? This movie is going to be horrible. This is not what I want. And I don't know why they're saying this. Because if you pick up a comic book and read Modern Catwoman, she wears this. I don't know if this is actually a cat suit, but this is extremely reminiscent of a cat suit. I'm not going to say it is. When people are saying this is unsexy, doesn't show any skin, oh my god, just shut up. Everyone who says that, just shut up. Did you, do you want the, do you want the outfit from Catwoman? Is that what you really want? Because that's what you really want, then no. Just no. That's horrible. I want this. Now, I, I think there will be a cowl, and, the, and there's a chance that she might wear a, a whip around her waist. And I should have two images here. Um, not the third one, because there is another image that just shows her wearing a dress. But I don't have much to say about that one. But, the thing I do have to say is that in the second one, you kind of see the belt. Or you kind of see like a belt with a, with like a utility thing where you can put packages in there. And that looks cool. This is what I think a cat burglar would wear. I honestly think a cat burglar would wear this. And you got to remember, in this, she's probably just going to be a cat burglar. She's probably not going to be Catwoman. She's probably not going to use that name. And this looks really cool. And I like the goggles. The goggles look a lot better than what they usually use in standard continuity. Uh, my friend that's a big Modern Warfare fan, I haven't talked to him yet, but I'm pretty sure he's going to say, oh, the goggles look much better than they do in the comics. It took me a while to get past uh, get past that in current con current comics, but this is very very good. This is exactly what I think. I don't know how easy it is to move in, but obviously they're going from this. But people were saying that they're just ripping off other movies and they're doing this just because other movies did this. And uh, I know I know GI Joe, um, the lead GI Joe heroine. The, female one um wore a cat suit that's what it is called a cat suit and i apologize if you think this is ripping off other movies because other movies use cat suits but guess what the cat suit has been connected with catwoman for a long time probably 10 years i'm not sure on the number but it's been a long time so don't say catwoman's ripping off anybody uh because Catwoman's been using this type of outfit for a while. She originally wore a dress, but read the comics. I like this outfit. I think it's really awesome. I can't wait to see what else. I hope the whip is part, and I hope the cowl looks kind of cool. I don't think there'll be cat ears per se, but I think they'll do something along the line. I don't think she's going to do cat puns like meow or anything like that but we're gonna have to see this is just an image and also i do have to state this don't get so pissed off about a one frame image you don't know much about it uh in closing i want to keep this video relatively short in closing i did want to mention that a lot of people think this is her stealing the the bat pod i didn't think about that actually i thought it was her borrowing it from batman near the end of the film a lot of people think this is early in the film i think this is at the end of the film and i think that i think at this time in the movie she's probably not wearing a helmet because there's no reason for for it like i don't know like i i can't explain why she's not wearing her cowl or a mask because i think she will have a mask but 
I don't even know if this will actually be in the movie. This could just be... This could be them wanting to show the face. This could be like a scene where they just took off the mask so they could actually have a promotional image. That's quite possible. You cannot take these images and assume they're 100% in the movie. And I do have to bring up the, uh, the Last Airbender is that entire first trailer wasn't in the movie. It was a promotional trailer. It was there to get people excited about the movie. It was a teaser trailer. So yeah, I like it. Please leave a comment below telling me if you like it, if you hate it. I want to know what you think. Uh, you can leave a video response too. Uh, this movie's looking great. I can't wait to see it. And uh, I love this image. I love it. I think this is Scream's Catwoman. And please read comics and then tell me if this doesn't scream Catwoman. And I think Anne Hathaway will do a great job. And I'll, uh, I'll see you next time, YouTube.